इलेक्ट्रिक जनरेटर और डायनामो इट इज इलेक्ट्रिक डिवाइस इन विच मैकेनिकल एनर्जी इज कन्वर्टेड इन टू इलेक्ट्रिक एनर्जी प्रिंसिपल ऑन विच प्रिंसिपल इट वर्क इट वर्क ऑन द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक इंडक्शन एंड ई एम एफ इज इंड्यूस्ड इन द कॉइल वेन एवर अमाउंट ऑफ मैग्नेटिक फील्ड लिंक विद द कॉइल चेंजेस फ्लेमिंग्स राइट एंड रूल इंडिकेट द डायरेक्शन ऑफ इंड्यूस करेंट नो डिस्कस द कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड वर्किंग जनरेटर हैज द रेक्टेंगुलर कॉइल हैविंग लार्ज नंबर ऑफ टर्न वी हैव शोन ओनली वन टर्न दैट इज ए बी सी डी दिस इज नॉन एज द आर्मेचर कॉइल विच इज मेड ऑफ इंसुलेटेड कॉपर वायर विच इज वाउंडेड ओवर लिमिटेड soft iron core this i i have symboled it it is a soft iron core two hollow metallic rings r1 and r2 these rings known as the slip rings connected at the ends of the armature coils these rings rotate with the rotation of the coil the coil is placed between the two pole one is the north pole and another is the south pole b1 and b2 are two flexible brushes made up of carbon these are used to pass an electric current from the coil to the external rod that is the rl external load means it may be any electrical device it may be refrigerator it may be television it may be tube light anything if we rotate this armature coil like this then arm ab will move inward and arm cd will move outward it means amount of magnetic field associated with the coil ab cd will change and according to fleming's right hand rule current will induced in the ab from b to a and in the cd from d to c so in the external resistance the current is flowing like this after half rotation initially the ab was moving in the inward direction now the ab will move outward and cd will move inward direction so initially current was flowing from d to c now the current will flow from c to d initially the current was flowing from b to a now the current is flowing from a to b what we observe we observe the direction of flow of the current in the external resistance also changes initially it was flowing like this now the current is flowing like this so after every half rotation direction of current is changing this is known as the alternating current if in place of the slip rings we use the split ring then we can produce the dc current also we can see in this animation that direction of flow of current is changing after every half rotation this armature coil rotates and when the armature coil rotates the magnetic field is changing when the magnetic field associated with the coil is changing induced current is produced and the bulb is glowing direct current and alternating current direct current is the current that always flow in one direction this is the direct current direction is always positive it may be negative also this is also dc current and this current we get from the battery alternating current is the current that changes the direction periodically like here initially current is positive after half it is negative one advantage of the ac over dc is that it can be transmitted over long distance without much loss of energy